Hey guys, guess who's back for video number dos, two, two. Um, right now. Um, it's been, let's see, ooh. Stuff that back in there. Just so you know, this bra is not the right size. Okay, I already know. I got stuff hanging out the bottom. I understand. I'm not buying new bras until these babies drop. Anyways, it's been my surgery again was February 17th. To oh, dang. It's been almost three months since my surgery. Uh, wow, I can't even believe it's been that long. Honestly, the hardest part about all of this is waiting to see what they look like. That is the most difficult part for me. I'm an impatient person. I suck at waiting. I suck at patience. So that to me has been the most difficult part is just waiting to see what they look like. So uh, this video, uh, I had a lot to say in the first video. There's not really going to be a lot to say in this video because... Uh, it's kind of self-explanatory and it's kind of like visualizing as far as um, seeing from last video to this video, seeing uh, how they dropped. So I'm just going to show you guys. So this is what they look like from the side at this point. A lot of side boob. And this little thing is coming back because at first this was like pulling. So this little part of your armpit that you, that you naturally have. Couldn't see it. So this is what they look like uh, front from a front view. But like I said, keep in mind, this bra... Oh, by the way, this bra is the same exact one as the blue one. It's just in white and same size and everything. But uh, it is a little small. So uh, it is pushing them together some. But all in all, uh, it's... Sorry, I'm like giving you guys a show. But... Yeah, so basically, this is what they look like. They're way more boob-like up here, I feel like. They're not as, you know, rounded and implant-looking. Uh, let me show you guys the scar. Uh, the scar used to be up here on my boob, so I can definitely feel like the scar is getting more into place and it's getting more in the crease. And uh, the lights on the scar right now are making them look, is making it look a lot more red. But it's actually fading beautifully. Uh, I'm so happy with like the scar, how it's going down. Uh, so I'm like fidgety right now. But um, yeah, so I'm doing the stretches and the ones that are pushing inward, pushing downward, and pushing upward. But as you can see, they're much more like jiggly, I guess. <laughs> they're much more uh, soft and uh, they're getting there. They're gonna they're gonna take about a year to look how they're gonna look naturally like for years to come so I'm just waiting it out seeing what's going on uh, as you can tell it's definitely more of a visual um, when I turn sometimes I can feel it a little bit like fold right here but I talked to my doctor and he was like it's perfectly normal it's just uh, the implant folding over a little bit and it's just going right back into place it's not like it's slowly flipping over or anything so everything looks good so far yeah so basically that's really it it's just waiting it out and seeing seeing what happens and just i'm excited uh my friend actually uh like i told you last time two people that i knew uh booked a consultation with this doctor and one of them had their surgery so she's a few days out now maybe like maybe like a week now but yeah she's she likes them so far you know she's good uh her recovery is a little bit different than mine so just so you know everybody's going to be different everybody's pain level is different so some people might take longer than others but you know i after day three i was good i felt like i could do anything even though i shouldn't have like um i felt like i could do a lot you know because i was pretty much asleep for three days straight like that's what it felt like um besides eating and going to the bathroom and you know a little bit of you know consciousness here and there but usually it was just just asleep for like three days straight but after that I was good it was very easy for me like 
if I ever wanted anything else, I would be, I would have no hesitations about the actual surgery. But this is all I really wanted. Uh, I'm very happy with my results. I love, love, love my doctor, his, the nurses that he has. Like, I'm so happy that I found him um, through a mutual friend. Like, it's not like I went on YouTube and found him. I found him through a mutual friend. And then I kind of looked up uh, his practice and his photos and stuff. But yeah, I was like... Like, I'm just so happy because I've seen some botched boob jobs. So I'm really happy. Like, they fit my body. Uh, I'm not super thin. Uh, I'm petite, which means I'm 5'2". I'm uh, like 140. I fluctuate um, weight a lot, but I'm like around 140. So I'm like, I'm like a thicker 5'2". So, you know, I have a little body. Uh, I'm not super thin, but I, I am really short. I'm just not super thin. So uh, they fit me. Uh, they fit me well. I have a pretty athletic athletic body. I don't know. <laughs> That's the best way I can describe it. But uh, yeah, they fit me really well, and I'm in love with them. Uh, and I wouldn't change anything. I highly recommend the doctor. If you are in the Atlanta area, I strongly, strongly suggest you check out this doctor. At least check him out if you don't book with him because he does some very natural looking uh boob jobs and they're very um they're very just natural regardless of the size like uh the friend who i had she has an athletic body she's a she's like five four and she's way smaller than me very very like thin athletic you know what i mean like very like it doesn't look like she has any fat on her body at all and uh, she actually went bigger than me but uh they look they still look great like so far you know what i mean they look fine so uh yeah i would strongly recommend this doctor and if you have any more questions for me feel free to email me hit me up on social media and i can answer your questions in another video or i can just answer them straight up uh if a bunch of people ask me the same question i can just do another video and yeah uh, i'm here for you guys so just let me know so yeah, this one was very quick and easy. Uh, just a little quick update. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being along with me with my journey. And I am so thankful for you because you guys uh, you guys definitely showed me that you, there's people out there who are, uh, who are like me, who are creeps and wanted to know exactly, you know, wanted to see all these videos and wanted to know. You want to like do as much research as possible and if this helps somebody out there then i did my job so thank you guys so much for watching and i will talk to you next time